How many green thumbs? My name is Brandon, here to bring you an exciting video today. First of all, welcome back to my fertilizer lab, where I am going to show you how to make all the fertilizers for the upcoming gardening season as cheap as possibly with your own home remedies. So today I'm going to show you how to make calcium and calcium phosphorus available nutrients for less than $5. And some things you're going to need are eggshells, a way to start fire, apple cider vinegar or rice vinegar, and some bones. So stay tuned and we'll show you just how to do that. we have step one complete it's on to step two but before we do that a few things to go over so a if we're looking for calcium the best source we can use is our used over eggs or eggshells now I know a lot of people bust these up and throw them into the hole but to make it go further we can take eggshells mix it with vinegar and that is going to extract the calcium along with all the other minerals and nutrients that are in the eggshells to provide it to the plants. Now if we want to switch things over and kick it into high gear for flowering, we would want more calcium and phosphorus and that is when the fruit set starts to happen. And that's what we're going to use is our leftover bones from pork chops like we have here or any steaks or any kind of ribs. You can save those bones, char them as black as you can get them, whether that be you put them in a fire or you put them on the uh, grill. It is best to do it outside, but if you have to, over the uh, oven with a fan on and do expect a little smell. So come along and we'll show you the rest of the process here. So that was the exciting part. Hopefully you all enjoyed the science experiment, science experiment much like I do. Uh, the last part, you store these away in a dark cool place for one week and you'll know when it's done when basically you see the fizzing and everything stop. So usually seven to ten days we can strain it off and then it can be used as a fertilizer. So thanks for watching. I hope you guys are all getting excited about seed starting and we'll see you next week. Peace.